Hey, Josh with Green Acres Lawn Care. Uh, I've got lots and lots of questions about seeding. Uh, so I wanted to just go over a few points. It's gonna be a little bit longer of a video, I apologize, but uh, there's a lot of things to point out. And so while we have already done and we are doing aerations and overseeds, uh, it is critical to know the difference. And so uh, when we apply seed as an overseed, it's not necessarily too early for that because the seed uh, is protected by the thatch and the existing turf and it's going to take three to five weeks for that seed to germinate and get tall enough to potentially be affected by frost. And so uh, if you have damage, as you can see here under this maple tree, as well as the, the dogs, um, They've, they've pretty much destroyed this whole area. Uh, it is not recommended to plant any seed right now. Uh, it is too early. It is uh, only the end of April, and so you really wanna wait a couple more weeks. The reason being is if you get seed to germinate, which you will, perennial ryegrass will germinate within uh, seven days or so, and uh, bluegrass will take about three weeks or so, it will uh, be completely affected by frost, which we will have more frost here coming up. And so <laughs> rule of thumb is to, uh, we, we've always said Mother's Day. Mother's Day is kind of your good rule of thumb to where you can plant your vegetable gardens, uh, you can start seeding, uh, whether you're repairing or installing new seeded areas and that sort of thing. And so uh, please wait, it is too early uh, even though ground temperatures are warm enough and the seed will germinate, uh, we have to worry about air temperatures right now more so than ground temperatures. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Otherwise, uh, wait a few more weeks and then get that seed down.